Hello everyone, in this video we have this interesting problem. We have a to the third power plus b to the third power is equal to c to the fourth power. And then we are saying that a, b and c belong to integer where a is not equal to b and then b is also not equal to c. And we have to find the values of a, b and c. But before we begin, you know the deal already, pause the video and try first. And if you are new here, consider subscribed and also don't forget to like this video. Now let's get started. We have a to the third power plus b to the third power is equal to c to the fourth power could be written as c to the third power times c. Great. Now from here, I'm going to let c equal to k to the third power plus l to the third power where k and l belong to integer greater than 1. And then k is never equal to l. Okay? Then I'm going to let a equal to kc and then b equal to lc. Now, wherever I see a in this equation, I'm going to put kc. Then wherever I see b, I'm going to put lc. Okay? So this equation over here becomes kc all to the third power plus lc all to the third power is equal to c to the third power times. Now we have c to be k to the third power plus l to the third power, okay? So we have here to be k to the third power plus l to the third power. Great. Now from here, let's simplify this. We have k to the third power times c to the third power then plus L to the third power times C to the third power is equal to C to the third power into K to the third power plus L to the third power. Great. Now, considering the left-hand side, you can see we have C to the third power here. Then we also have it here. So we can factor it out, right? So we have C to the third power into K to the third power plus L to the third power. And this is equal to c to the third power into k to the third power plus l to the third power. Great. Now you can see the left hand side is equal to the right hand side. So we can conclude that a is equal to kc, b is equal to lc, and then c is equal to k to the third power plus l to the third power. Now we are saying that a, b, and c are integers where a is never equal to b, and then b is also not equal to c. And then we also have k and l, which are also integers, where k is also not equal to l. Now from here, if we assume that k is equal to 2, and then l is equal to 3, then we have c is equal to 2 to the third power plus 3 to the third power, which is equal to 2 to the third power is 8, then plus 3 to the third power is 27, okay? So we have C to be 8 plus 27 is nothing but 35. So now that we know the value of C, we can easily find A and B, right? So when C is equal to 35, we have A is equal to KC where K is 2 over here. So we have 2 into C is 35. So we have 35 over here. 2 times 35 is nothing but 70. Okay, so we have A is equal to 70. Then when C is equal to 35, we have B is equal to LC, where L is equal to 3, and then C is 35. 3 times 35 is 105. Okay, so we have B is equal to 105. Now we have A to be 70, B to be 105, and then C is equal to 35, okay? Now let's go ahead and then plug these values into the original equation, which is a to the third power plus b to the third power equals c to the fourth power, okay? So when a is equal to 70, we have 70 to the third power plus b, where b is 105, so we have 105 to the third power, and this is equal to 35 to the fourth power. 70 to the third power is equal to 3430000, then plus 105 to the third power is equal to 
0.57625. And this is equal to 35 to the fourth power is equal to 1500625. Okay. Now, if you sum 3430000 and then 1157625, we have 1500625. And this is equal to the exact same thing, right? We have 1500625. And now you can see that the left hand side is equal to the right hand side, right? So we can conclude that the value of A is equal to KC, which is an integer. Then B is equal to LC, which is also an integer. Then C is equal to K to the third power plus L to the third power. So guys, you can go ahead and then test your own values, but make sure K and L must not be equal. And lastly, they must be greater than one, okay? So guys, I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Please give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Have a nice day and see you again on the next video.